Uh, I mean, it's an honor to get, get this from my city. I take a lot of pride in Clovis and, and where I'm from. I mean, no matter how boring it may be on weekends and stuff, but I mean, I love where I'm from. I really do. And I just want to thank God because, I mean, I've just been blessed through high school, through college. I just had a lot of great opportunities in life. And, and, and growing up, I really never had somebody to, to look up to, like as far as athletics that came out of Clovis. And hopefully I can do that for some of the kids here. And, I just want to be someone that can motivate kids to do something with their life. Jay, Jay's not only a great basketball player, he's a great person. And I think our community really respects that and rallies around that. And then obviously he was a great talent in high school and, you know, led us to three uh, state tournaments. And, uh, and then going on to Texas Tech, which is near Clovis, well, uh, you know, people were able to go see him play and follow his career. And, you know, he's, he's quietly worked his way into the Tech record books. and worked his way into a fan favorite there as well. And my family's been there with me. They've been my, my role models all my life. And they just taught me just to, I mean, something my grandma and my mom always tell me is, uh, it's nice to be nice. And it's just, it is, good things just come with that. And I feel like they just instilled a lot of good things in me and just helped me become the person I am today, along with everybody here in this city. So. You know, Jay's the kind of guy that has just kept working on his skills and, and uh, trying to become a better player every year. And I think that's shown, you know, from uh, where he was at Tech as a freshman and where he is now, you know, it's a, it's a big jump. And, uh, you know, we're hoping that uh, after Tech he can take another jump, and I think he's good enough to, to play at the professional level.